Hello, uh, how the fudge you doing? Hey guys, D-Field here bringing you another episode of Factions Let's Play. And today we have another solo episode for you guys here today. And I want to wish you guys personally a happy new year, guys. The 2014 new year, the 2014 year in its entirety was just so amazing, guys. We started at about 3,000 uh 4,000 subs at the beginning of the new year and now we are at a whopping 109 almost 109 thousand subscribers guys thank you so much for joining me on my epic journey and thank you guys so much for all of your support and I couldn't honestly do this without any of you guys here and I just really 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 wanted to give you guys a quick thank you on my main faction series because obviously factions is where it all started out and for those of you guys who have been watching me from the start Deep, deep, deep thank you to all of you guys because I would not be here if it weren't for all of you lovely people on the channel. So I don't know what the heck this is, but it kind of looks scary and there's a hole in the roof which kind of alerts me, but I'm just going to go ahead and try this out anyway. What is this? I just literally just saw this as I logged in. Oh, there's TNT. Am I going to shoot up? Wee! <laughs> oh no, I missed it. I'm supposed to land. Is there, a, is there a room up there? There has to be a room up there. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Here we go. One. Okay, there you go. What the heck is this? It's like a little It's like a little TNT cannon that shoots you up. Oh, oh. Oh, it saved me. Oh, there's like a trip wire here. Oh, you're supposed to hit this trip wire and you're and it's supposed to push you one block over so that you land on this level So it looks like obviously my faction has been doing a lot of work I don't know exactly what we're building in this top room yet But uh, you know just a lot of progress being made on the base so far and Saturday is actually really really busy right now uh, Helping my family set up for New Year's so I'm gonna have a pretty pretty short episode today uh, Due to the fact that we are it's just literally full holiday swing full Merry or happy new year kind of uh, blessings and uh, uh, just oh no did somebody x-ray our base oh wait no what is this oh it's just a random I thought somebody x-rayed our base right here I was about to I was about to flip out right there and then look at this guys so it looks like Snix and iZero Logic have been doing their fair bit of amount of work and if you guys remember from yesterday's episode um, this was just basically a clear room and it looks like it looks like this is gonna be our potion brewery room right here nice little, this is the coolest looking fireplace I've seen in a while that is that is actually pretty legitimate. Nice, nice. I'm look liking the look of this base. So we're probably going to end up moving out of this base after the new year where we can kind of have a little bit more time to actually play uh, factions um, a little bit more seriously than we kind of are right now. Because, you know, obviously... All of the all of our faction members including insanity and myself we're all really really busy with our family right now just spending time with family and whatnot and I don't think that I don't think that piston is actually working uh, properly how it's supposed to but anyways guys I do have something to show you guys our our big 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 ally impulse uh, let's see if he's online can I T can I TP to the blaze? Our, our really big ally, uh, Impulse, has um, provided with us a, a blaze farm. For the meantime, it's just going to be a temporary blaze farm as we're still setting up our own. And let me go TPO, Lil Bucky Badger. So he is a challenger. on. I think he's one of the leaders. And then what does he say? Adding 16 spawners once you see it. Built by Lil Bucky Badger. Also, check out my E-chest. It's OP. Let's check out his E-chest real quick. Let's let's check out this, this E-chest real quickly here. Holy crap. So many creeper eggs. 44 blaze Play spawners and he's got all this stuff probably he went to the nether ended up uh, collecting a quite a fair bit of blaze spawners from the nether so the nether is probably cleared out by this point and I do have some uh, blaze spawners myself um, how do I add <laughs> how, how do I add more spawners in is there is there a safe way inside I wonder if there's a I wonder if there's a safe way inside there because I I want to make sure like that I want to I want them I want to show them that we're we're trusted and that we're not gonna raid this blaze spawner so um <clears throat> let's see lol no okay so there, there's no safe way inside there I want to add two more spawners <clears throat> right before we actually uh, get this done so let's see let's let's see if we can try to do this I'm gonna god apple up for the do I have any fire resistance I do not let's let's god apple up for the fire resistance. And then let's see if we can actually get inside here and add two more spawners. So, 
It's just two spaces away. Okay, this is gonna be kind of difficult, but we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it work. All right, here we go. Let's kill all the blaze first. Holy crap, this is gonna be hard. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna add. Oh no, this is gonna be trouble. This this ain't gonna be good. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many blaze everywhere. There's so many blaze <laughs> everywhere. Okay, so let's put um let's put the obsidian. I wish I had another building block. One, two, and then the the spawner. The spawner three. There we go. Let's find this. Let's find this. Dude, these blaze have no aim. Oh my! I'm standing still. The blaze have not hit me. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Look how many blaze there are, and they can't hit me. Are they serious right now? Is this a glitch? I think this is glitch. Look at this. <laughs> There's a glitch here. They're not even hitting me. I'm not in God mode or anything. They're, they're just not hitting me right now. What the heck is that? <laughs> the blaze are not hitting. Maybe it's because of my potion. It might It might be because of my... um. It might be just because I have uh, a fire resistance on. Why are they not hitting me? That's so weird. I've never seen that before. Little Bucky Badger helping me out over here. So thank you to our faction allies impulse. Look at this. Why are none of them are hitting me? None of them are able to land a shot on me. That is so cool. I have never, ever seen that before. So there we go. Oh, no. I fr freaking put a hole in there. There we go. Put that. Fix that there. All right, Bucky Badger. Let's get out of here, man. Let's get out of here, dude. Let's get out. Oh. All right. Here we go. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> here. Take it. Take it under pearl, man. Take it under pearl. Take it under pearl. See, he's taking damage. How come I'm not taking damage? Let's go, Bucky. <laughs> Get out of there. <laughs> Get out of there, buddy. There you go. Okay. <laughs> There's another pearl. There. Under pearl out. Under pearl out. You can do it. Yes, we made it. Okay, good. Okay, let's place this back. I got the glass because I have a silk touch pickaxe, obviously. There you go. <laughs> nice. Okay, let me set home blaze here. Set home blaze. So we're going to be able to actually expand this a little bit further. It's got room to fill up another couple of spawners. So we're going to be able to make a little bit of money off of this little farm that we have here. So quick thanks to Impulse, uh, one of our big, big, big allies. They have so many members online. Like, it's insane. Like, that's crazy. But that's exactly what uh, we've been doing now. I, I don't know if I want to spoil this right now now and I don't know if I want to actually discuss it but here I'm gonna talk about it just a little bit now obviously um, let me do slash F who let's see obviously one of our biggest enemies um, due to just you know just for fun just for fun here on the faction series one of our biggest enemies is toxic now um, I've been sold a couple of toxic bases but none of them really had anything good enough for me to actually raid so I don't know if I don't know if the the toxic faction has actually um, I don't know if they have a bunch of fake bases where they've just claimed it, like just random land and then just didn't make a base there because I I've been uh, trying to get a recording on raiding toxic for the longest time Time. and it's just it just hasn't been working out it hasn't been working out for me like I, I don't know why like whenever I find any of their claims like there's just nothing there it's not worth an episode for me to actually um for me to actually record it and post it so I've been I've been asking around and I've been looking around the toxic faction and it looks like they have a couple of vault claims like I'm just asking general information from from the rest of their faction but it, it sounds to me that they have a lot of vault claims in their uh, faction so they have a, they have one like major shared vault now my one goal is I'm gonna try to persuade I don't know exactly who I'm gonna be talking to yet I'm gonna try to persuade one of those um I'm gonna try to persuade one of those uh, people who are in their vaults or either has a set home in their vault or maybe they got in somehow, like the, somebody accidentally TP'd them inside. I wanna ask them to see if I could convince them to betray Toxic and get a raid on one of their huge bases. So um, I'm probably gonna roll into a clip sometime soon because it's not gonna happen within the next, it's gonna happen within the next couple hours. I'm gonna try all today to see if I can get that clip going. And obviously I'm not gonna give out who is gonna be betraying their faction so that they can help me in the future. And, uh, yeah, we'll see where exactly we can get to from there. But quick thank you to freaking um, uh, the rest of Impulse uh, for being able to put a bunch of these spawners in. And before I even roll into the next clip, uh, let's go ahead and do a... Can someone sell me 16... Less, oh wait, some creeper eggs? Okay, let's see if we can get some creeper eggs from the rest of the people here. Because if we do end up getting a raid on Toxic, it's going to be an inside raid. Um, it's going to definitely be a good idea for us to have some creeper eggs. Because we do not have any creeper eggs at all stockpiled in here. And uh, let's see if we can do it. How, how much each? How much each? Let's see how much we can... How much? How many creeper eggs we can get. I, I only need like about a stack. 5k, uh, 7,000. Alright, E chest. Uh, put it... Put it in your... E, put it in your inventory. 
Put it in your inventory. Do you feel I can sell you some for 5,000 each? Okay, so who is this his name? Default PVP. End of C. Default PVP. All right, we're going to wait for him to put it in his uh, inventory. Hopefully hopefully they have them. End of C. Ski Freak. All right, Ski Freak's got 32. Oh, my gosh. How much each, Ski Freak? All right. Uh, okay, he sold me a complete half stack of there. How much each? Are, let me pull up a calculator so I'm ready for this calculation right here. Uh, Ski Freak says, um, I, I have no idea. Ski Freak is also another one of our big allies. They're the faction Fear. They go for 10,000 each. They go for, t okay, so 10,000 ish. 32 times, oh, that's, that's obviously just uh, 5,000. He's giving me a discount. Oh, what a guy. That's because we're allies. 32 times 5. So this will pay Ski Freak 160,000. So there we go. Let's go ahead and put this in our e chest. Now, guys, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to spend the next couple of hours. I'm going to talk to some toxic members and see if I can get them to betray their beloved faction. We'll be right back. Here we go. Negotiation time is commencing. Alright guys, I finally convinced somebody I think to actually give me this uh, base raid. Uh, they logged off of the server because they did not want to be part of, they did not want to be seen in any part of this episode. So I've got two of my buddies with me, uh, Ski Freak, like the one from the previous clip, Ski Freak and Little Bucky. They're both going to join me in this raid because obviously if I need backup and Toxic is a huge faction, if I need backup, Insanity is not online and I decided to bring them along with me for this raid so that we could actually get some stuff. Done, but before I actually start that, let me go ahead and grab some potions. Where are all of our potions? It's gonna be in the potion room now. Let me grab some potions just in case we do get into some PvP battles because it's gonna be pretty crazy if we um if we start to get into a battle inside the toxic base itself and before we can raid anything. So let's go ahead and prepare just a little bit. I'm gonna grab um let's see five creeper eggs in my inventory just for right now, just just in case that it can happen. I've got ender pearls, I've got all this ready. I'm gonna go ahead and ask them if they're ready. Slash home toxic. Now I'm gonna go TPO here. His name is Lil Bucky Badger, and TPO here, Ski Freak. Okay, so they set home right above this little farm right here. I'm not exactly sure what this is, but if I do slash F map, look at this big base. They're like right on the world border, guys. They're right on the world border. They're literally their base is literally just along this entire world border right here. So I'm not sure exactly what's happening right here, but the farm looks like it's looted. Let's go down. The farm looks like it's already. Oh, it looks like they, he might have warned his faction. He might have warned his faction because now there's a hole over here. And let's let's come. Let's go check this out. Let's go down here. There has has to be something else here though there has to be something down here that makes this um this such an op base because there's no there's no reason why they would have this here if there's nothing here so let's go ahead and eat a god apple um i'm gonna eat chest i'm gonna where, where's the creeper egg i'm gonna i'm gonna creeper egg through okay okay all right here we go so let's go ahead and plop a creeper egg down and let's hopefully this blows up and then we go there we go we've got a hole down uh anything here is there anything in this thing at all? Oh, there's a bunch of iron golem stuff. So they had an iron golem farm. They might have been warned. Oh, there's something here. Oh, there's here. There's a guy here. There's a guy here. There's a guy here. Oh, potion up, potion up, potion up, potion up. Go, 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 go. Oh, I double ate the freaking potions. That was so cool. How did I do that? Uh, Kill Andy, kill Andy, kill Andy. Uh, focus on Andy, guys. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait. You guys go ahead. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my flipping God. Did he just hit? What the fuck? What the heck? <laughs> okay, let me go slash uh, kit master two kit master. Oh my god, he just wrecked me. Oh my god, how did he? How did that? How did that happen? E chest. I lost. I just lost five creeper eggs right there. Okay, let's grab some god apples. How did he out hit a god apple effect? Oh my god, that guy is strong. How? What does he have? Slash back. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep those two. Oh, there's something down here. Okay, oh, there's something down here. What is down over here? Um, get get. Oh, he's dying. He's dying. Oh, get Andy. Get Andy. Get Andy. Oh, his armor's gone. Okay, all right. Just focus on Andy. Uh, is there anything here? Is there anything good in here? George's OP crap. Oh no, it looks like they looted everything already. They knew we were coming. It might have been a setup. We might have gotten set up right here. What? Oh, there you go. His armor's breaking. His armor's breaking. This is definitely a. This is this guy is definitely a master. He's got. He has to be a master donator because there's no way he killed me in like three hits. He out hit my god apple effect, guys. Like what the heck? Come on, come on, ski freak, help me out over here. And he's dead. Yes, I got my stuff back and I got my head. Yes. Nobody gets my head. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, you're strong. Oh my <laughs> Okay, is there anything in these chests? Uh we might as well just blow up. 
We might as well just blow up uh, this entire toxic base here. It looks like, oh, it looks like they knew we were coming though. No. Okay, but what we want to do is we want to get them to move out of here. Congrats, D-Field. You managed to get in. Sucks, though I took everything out already. You missed out on two iron golems and three pigments. Andy, co-owner of Toxic PS, D-Field, you're going down. No, Andy knew we were coming. No, 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 no. Andy, did you find out who betrayed you? Oh no, oh he's out hitting my god apple effect, how is that even possible? Oh my gosh, he's like, he's nearly out hitting my god apple effect. Like holy crap, he's strong, he's got some strong freaking out. He must be a challenger, he's got, he's gotta be a chal- Oh my god, my, my freaking master kits are dying over here. Oh, let's see if we can get out of here, man. Let's see if we can get out of here. Oh, he kicked the betrayer. He kicked the betrayer. Oh no, they found out who helped me out. Okay, let's see if we can get out of here. We need to we need to TP away. We need to TP out of here, guys. We need to we need to get out of here. Andy's chasing us. Guys, ski freak, knock him off. Knock him off the mountain. Unless we got we got to kill him again if he comes up here. We got we got to kill him again if he comes up here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're no longer combat 5. 4 3 2 no, I can't TP out. Oh, no. Get him. Get him, guys. Get him. Get him. Get him. My armor's gonna break. My armor's gonna break. Hold on. How do I How do I do this? Let me get Let me get this on. Um, oh, no. Oh, no. I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna die again. Kill him. Kill him. Help me out. <laughs> Bucky, help me. <laughs> Run. I've got no armor. Kit. I've got my kit diamond, too. I've got my kit diamonds from winning the kit. So, okay. Let's, let's put this on. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Right there. I gotta hide here, boys. I gotta hide. I gotta hide. I'm no longer camp at five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Get out of there. Get out of there. Run. <laughs> well, let's, let's TP everybody in. Okay, let me each have some of this stuff so I save uh, the stuff that I did recover. I do not want two heads of mine po poking into there. Oh, gosh. Good. Let, I'm, I'm going to TP everyone in there. Ready? No, uh, there was this was the same raid that Bucky had. Bucky told me he had a raid on them too. Okay, here we go. Um, let's put this in our inventory. Let's go to slash back. Um, let's do uh, TP toggle. TP TP to me. Everyone. TP E TP accept. There we go. Let's TP everybody in here. We're just gonna get everybody. Oh no 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 no! Come on come on come on come on! Whoo! Oh that got up. Go 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 go! Just, I'm gonna have everybody TP in here. Come on, we got, we have, we need to get everybody to have a set home in here. I'm probably gonna die again, which is fine. Not a big deal. We gotta just make sure Andy doesn't get out. This is Andy, it, I guess this is Andy's, uh, one of Andy's main faction vaults because he's the one who does not, he does not want anybody to get into here. So we wanna have as many people have set homes in here as possible so that they, they are forced to move. Like we're gonna, it's gonna be very, very, very easy for them to, uh, for them to get out. Andy's getting away, he's getting away. Do I have a boat? Do I have a bow? Come on. Move. 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 I got him. I got him. He's combat tag. Perfect. 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 Okay. Good. 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 Let me ETP accept people into here. Come on, baby. Come here, Andy. Come here, Andy. Oh, he's blocking it off. What a smart guy. Let me E-chest. Let me grab a creeper egg. Can I, can I, can I do this? Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to grab all the creeper eggs. Holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. I just want one. I just want one. I just want one. There you go. Oh my god, I'm dying. I'm about to die. Okay, I'm good. All right, we've TP'd a lot of people in there, though. We've TP'd a lot of people in there. If you're inside, TP everyone in. There you go. Go, 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 go. There you go. Okay, so, whew, we are getting rid of the toxic bases one by one. We're going to try to infiltrate toxic's main faction and people who are actually in there. I don't even know if they... I haven't checked yet. I'm going to check after this actual recording. I don't know if they kicked out who leaked that base to them, but hopefully he's actually uh, a little bit smarter and uh, does not... Um, he does not log on for a while so that they don't realize that it was him who did it. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching today's Factions Let's Play episode. If you guys did enjoy... Make sure you guys smash that like button for me. This is D Field. We'll see you guys later.